Hi, I'm Alison, and today I'm going to show you how quick and easy it is to raise a product assembly within Easify's bullet materials. Now in this scenario, we're running a model train company. So in the first instance, we're going to want to raise a new product. We'll give it a title. And then we'll go to the assembly tab, and this is where we add all the components that make up that product. So we're going to want to add a carriage surround, a couple of doors, a chassis and some wheels. Now you can see that this two centimetre wheel kit has a cog next to it. That shows its assembly in its own right. So we're going to add this two centimetre wheel kit and it becomes a sub assembly of this new product that we're raising. Now Easify is a multi-level bill of material system, which means you can have as many levels of sub-assemblies as you like within one product. So each product can contain a sub-assembly and that sub-assembly may also then contain another sub-assembly and so on and so on. When you drill into the sub-assembly on a product, you can see what it contains. So this sub-assembly contains two of the two centimeter wheels and an axle. Now on this carriage, I'm going to want six wheels. So I'm just going to update the quantity and you can see that it ripples on through the sub-assembly. Then I'm going to press OK to save that new product. Well, I hope that's been useful and I hope you've been able to see how quick and easy it is to raise a new product assembly within Easify's bill of materials. If you've got any questions, please leave them below and we'll reply to them or feel free to email us at sales at easify.co.uk. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.